Okay. okay, so we'll do uh, this mount from Straddle. Pull the cannonball in. Get your back. Load the cannon first. Stay tucked. Two, one, four. Good. Okay. To so dismount from Straddle out. Okay, Straddle. Good. Um, common fall coming over this way is if you just fall flat on your butt really fast, right? Falling this way, poof, right on your butt, that's a lot of... And also, you can get dizzy going up too fast, right? So we want to drop our flyer this amount really slowly. So how I do that is I'll support the shoulders here. So I'm taking some of the weight off my feet. Mm -hmm. So I'm doing the reverse of going from back fly to straddle. Right. Pushing the weight here, I'm slowly taking this foot, scooting it up one at a time underneath her butt. What that happens, what that does, as soon as I take that, it's going to put a lot of weight on my right hand because now I don't have that weight. So as soon as I put it under there, here, I can bend my knees and start putting her weight on my shins. Mm -hmm. So I'm scooting them underneath her butt there, on my shins, <laughs> scooting them underneath there too, underneath the butt, and then slowly bending them all the way down and then lifting my toes up. There's some there. Out. <laughs> okay. Let me know if there's anything I can clarify. You like yes, yes, cannonball. Load the cannon. Load it first and up. Sometimes if you go by too fast, yes. uh, your base won't be in synchronized with the time and it'll go over too far this way. So next time just load it first and then count together until you have a rhythm that's very defined with your base, then you can do that. Okay. So here, I'm tucking in close. I'm pushing up. She can start tucking her chin down and looking up. As soon as she's up there, I'm going to take a foot, scoot it around her butt this way. And that poor force is a lot of weight in my hands. So as soon as I do that, I'll bend my knees and put the other foot underneath her butt. And then bend down. Keep pushing forward and lifting up with my feet a bit. Helping them come up. So it's about that transition, getting the foot underneath. How can you do that easier? By pushing off up. And as soon as you're underneath here, She's going to want to slide forward onto you. So you've got to, as soon as you're underneath, bend your knee so that her weight is already shifting forward onto your shins. Scoot the other one under and out. Okay.